All right, guys. So we are in our garage, our tiny little working area here. Um, over the last uh, couple of months here, we've had quite a bit of snow, cold weather, so we haven't been able to do too much work on the hull itself. Um, we are at the fairing process. Uh, I have two layers on, I believe now. Uh, I got to sand it out still, but the weather's just been really crap over the last few months. So. Uh, we did go off site for a couple weeks uh, to do the major bulkheads, the big bulkheads. Uh, we didn't have enough room in our garage. No. Um, and we have been doing some fiberglassing in here. Uh, we haven't recorded a lot of it because it's really repetitive. So uh, we didn't want to bore you guys too much. Um, so we are working on the intermediate bulkheads today. Yep. Um, we're fiberglassing the entire sheet. Yeah, right, we'll do the entire sheet and we should be able to actually cut three intermediate bulkheads out of this sheet and still have a strip on the edge that we can use for the gunwale. Gunnel. Uh, gunnel, gunwale, whatever. <laughs> tomato, tomato. <laughs> All right, uh, so we're gonna use one layer of 17 ounce glass uh, for the intermediates. It's, uh, what does that equate to? I forget, 600 grams, I think it was, of glass. I forget, to be completely honest. Yeah, I think it was 600 grams. Um, and then we're going to peel apply the top. Uh, again, you guys have seen this, seen us do this a thousand times before. You know, maybe not a thousand, but probably a hundred anyway. I know, right? And uh, we're going to use the Total Bloat Slow Hardener. Two to one resin hardener. Um, we do have heat in the garage here. All right, so we're just going to put you guys on time lapse and hope you enjoy. Imagine this times three. Yeah, yeah, like I say, we've done a few already. We haven't recorded it, so. There's no reason to. Um, yeah. So. Oh, um, if you want to get 15% off of a Total Boat product, go to totalboat.com and use code Dauntless. It's a one time use code. Be sure to slam that like button. No, and, it's smash. Oh, smash. <laughs> smash, slam, and. Uh, no. Uh, smash, slam, and. <laughs> And subscribe and uh yeah smash comment. smash that like button there you go. subscribe and be sure to comment if you have any uh criticisms we love the comments guys we try to, to respond to all of them so all right thanks again for watching
start the floors. All of our bulkheads are currently glassed. Um, all our intermediates are done. Our uh, main bulkheads are done. We just have to do the final cuts once we flip the boat over. Um, so we're going to move on to the floors. Uh, we have the... I call it the bed board. I, I don't know really what the, the proper name for it is, but underneath the berth on one of the hulls is blocked off so the mattress will sit on top of here. So uh, that's this piece we're working on today. Um, I already have the floor for the berth area laid out. And then we only have the two cockpit floors and the two cabin floors to do after this. Um, we're actually pretty good timing for everything because weather is definitely changing for the better. We are early March right now. Yep. And uh, so we should be able to get back out to the boat, finish the fairing up, which we've been, you know, kind of dying to do lately because, <laughs> you know, we want to see some progress. But uh, yeah, once the boat's flipped over, everything should start going hopefully fairly, fairly quick. You know, there'll obviously be some times where we have to fit stuff and stuff like that. But. Another panel in the books. Looks good. Shiny. Look how shiny it is in the camera. And that's going to do it for this week's episode. Make sure you come back next week to see another step forward. Thanks for watching. No, you go. No, you. Why do I have to explain it? Spear glass. So much spear glass.